Hello. Welcome to the New York Cables, an informative hub for Ethernet cables and accessories. The topic we are going to discuss is about what is Fluke Test for Ethernet cables? The Fluke Tester has several parts. Number one, remote adopter. Number two, graphical display. Number three, rotatory operational modes. Number four, portable lightweight design. Number five, F connector and RJ45 tests. The gray cord is pre-assembled cable connected on the both ends. The test starts from a side of the fluke meter and ends at the B side of the device. The patch cord length may vary from 0.5 meters to 20 meters or so. So, why do we need a fluke test? For Ethernet cables, is it necessary to run a test? What figures it provide for Ethernet cables? Fluke tests provide figures for wire map testing, length measurements, attenuation testing, crosstalk testing, return loss testing, propagation delay testing, and certification testing. Here we have CAT, six unshielded twisted pair cable 23 American wire gauge. Running a fluke test and you can see the figures the test shows pass sign, not partially pass but it's completely authentic and all the figures are above standards for our cable. Here is a quick glance at the values shown. After running the fluke test on our bulk cat 6 riser and shielded twisted pair cable, it seems quite simple to install the ethernet cables at your office or data centers, but there are much technical aspects involved that decides the standard of the ethernet cable. Fluke test is for the quality of Ethernet cable and that how it will perform after installation. Hello YouTube fam. If you like the video just subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon. Comment and share the video. Start your journey with New York cables where performance matters.